Hi, my name is Yan Huang, and today I'm going to show you how to extract the URL from a hyperlinked cell in Microsoft Excel. Uh, so one of the reasons um, you would want to do this is, first of all, you'll be able to manipulate the data a lot easier when you isolate the hyperlinked text and the actual URL, because then you can do stuff like like um, concatenate uh, um, UTM tracking for Google Analytics to it or parse the URLs in any kind of way that you you need to with with the, the data so it's very powerful to be able to separate the hyperlink uh, from the hyperlink uh, text so uh, as an example I'm just gonna copy and paste this you know table here uh, and dump it into Excel Now note that if you're trying to do the other way around, for example, if let's say that you have a, um, if let's say that you're trying to create a link, it's fairly straightforward. To do that, you would type in hyperlink and then uh, HTTP, let's say yan411.com and yan411. And that is how you would create a hyperlink. But what I'm going to show you is how to reverse that. Now to create a hyperlink is very straightforward because Microsoft Excel has a built-in function to do that, which is the hyperlink function. To do, do the reverse of that, uh, they do not have a built-in function, so we have to use a VBA. Uh, which stands for Visual Basic for Applications. Now it sounds complicated because we have to now deal with programming, but um, it's pretty straightforward. Um, let me show you uh, how. So, um, what you want to do is uh, now I will have this blog post available on my blog, uh, and if you're watching this on YouTube, uh, I'll have a link to this page on my blog right beneath this uh, video. If you're not on YouTube, you can just go to my blog, yan411.com, search for this, uh, and you'll be able to find it. So what we're going to do is uh, hold down Alt F11, and that will open the um, Visual Basic Editor. Uh, the next step is to go to Insert Module. So I'm going to go to Insert Module. And now I'll, uh, what uh, you want to do is copy and paste this function in here. Uh, before I do that, check this out. If I type in equal sign, uh, get, See how nothing comes up in the preview because this uh, get URL function does not exist yet. But now when we put this in here, I'm going to save this uh, by control S. Now note that when you save it, you have to make sure that you change this from an Excel workbook to an Excel macro enabled workbook. Otherwise, it's not going to save the um, uh, to save the uh, save uh, your VBA code. Now if I go back to Excel here, um, and I type in equal sign, get. See how this function magically exists? It's not magic, we just did it, but um, it's pretty darn near close to magic. Bam! So that ex extracts the URL, and what I can now do is maybe even drag this down. And for all the ones that were hyperlinked, uh, um, it's... Yeah, these I think are just broken links or whatnot. But essentially, that's that's how you would would uh, do it. I mean, this is kind of messy just because I mass copied and pasted into it. But um, yeah, this is how you how you would do it. And I can do get URL, um, portfolio. So, and then uh, if all of these are because I think these are awkwardly merged cells, so that's why there's it was erroring out as I dragged it down. But in theory, you should be able to uh, to just do it once and then bulk do it uh, uh, for all of your links. So hopefully you found this helpful. And if you have, like this video, uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and um, leave a comment below. Feel free to leave a comment below. And also go to my blog, uh, yan411.com. Um, tons of, of valuable information. Uh, I have vi uh, videos sorted by categories. These are just some of the categories. There's a lot more. Um, and it covers, uh, 
a massive range of topics from Photoshop to Excel to uh, Google uh, Docs, Google Apps, uh, email marketing, coding, um, SEO. Uh, check it out. Other than that, thank you very much for watching and uh, thank you for subscribing. <music>